I'm, I'm now going to have a short presentation for you about uh, what Stargate Community Center is about. And because of uh, not to wear out our translator, I will show pictures that will give you an image of what the place is about. And uh, I will also encourage you to ask questions as we go. Or if you have ideas that you want to discuss, just stop me and talk for me. So, uh, uh, in 2001, I uh, started up at the community center as a volunteer. I just had my first baby. I was living in the neighborhood and I had uh, paternal leave. <laughs> so with my baby here, I was going into the office to Susan. <laughs> it says, community center, is there anything for children here? <laughs> and she said, no, but do you have an idea? <laughs> Obviously, I had some. Uh, my professional background is that I'm a teacher. So before I started to work with Sagna, I ran a kindergarten. And I also been uh, running a local radio station in my youth. And I've been involved in politics in my youth. In what? Politics. So uh, all my experience come to use in this job. And I think the, the most important thing I would, I would like to tell you is that the community center is nothing without the people. So when we started off running this place, we started with inviting the people in. Like Susan did with me, we did with several others. You can see here from the outskirts, this is the community center here. It's a thousand square meters on the corner. Uh, na tom obrázku můžete vidět i community center. And sorry, you mentioned some number. Uh, 1,000 square meters. Aha, uh, 1,000 square meters. Má rozlohu, ale teda vlhu. With a nice uh, plaza. Aha, uh -huh. má takto uh, náměstě. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. As you have to remember, square. Square náměstě, jako má děj. And... Uh, um, this is neighborhood day. And uh, as Martin also told you, uh, we have a very uh, wide mandate. And uh, it gives room for experimenting. So, uh, it's not right. This is not the model of community centers in Norway. This is one well, very special one.
And, and what we take is that this is what we have. And we didn't have a lot of money. And we didn't have a lot of money. But we had the house. And we had a we were given. Okay, Ileta is correcting me. I overheard that you were talking about the past. That in the past you had, you didn't have money, but you had house. Yes. Takže v minulosti mali dom, ale nemali peniaze. And we were given time to develop this place. So. A venovali svoj osobný čas na rozvoj. So the principle, the principle of sustainable development was really important to build something that would last. Veľmi dôležité, dôležitý bol princíp udržateľného rozvoja, rozvoja niečo, čo by trvalo v určitú dobu, alebo teda, čo by stále trvalo. And I think, at least in Norway, but probably also in many other countries, there's a very good sport in building huge cultural palace, spending a lot of money, and when the reality comes, they don't have the funding to run it. Aj v Norsku sa vyskytne, ale v mnohých krajinách je situácia, že investujú veľa peniazy do budov alebo do toho materiálneho a potom im neostávajú financie, aby to viedli alebo teda aby manažovali ten aktivity do budov alebo tej budovy organizácie. Oni začali od podlahy a postupne to budovali. And it is important that uh, we say that the community center is for the whole of the community, not for specific groups. As I learned in school, people are social beings. And they need to meet and interact. And the good thing about Sarve is that people live very close in small flats, so they have to get out of their apartment to be social. So uh, Except for this community center, there is a variety of theaters, cinemas, uh, pubs, bars, parks, meeting, lots of meeting places. <laughs> and you have two large sports clubs. And, and two, uh, uh, Voltaire Central. So the Voltaire Central, the purpose is to activate people. But the community center is facilitating. We're not that much in producing activity. Ale ich komunitné centrum nevytvára tak veľa aktivít. Oni facilitujú, oni napomáhajú ľuďom, aby sami nejaké aktivity prichádzali s nápadmi na nejaké aktivity. So of course there are resource persons in the community that would like to use the house. Those who are socially involved. Hovorí o cílovej skupine ich komunitného centra a sú to spoločenskí zahrnutí ľudia alebo dobrovoľníci. Ich komunitné centrum zahrňa dobrovoľníkov. People like you. Ľudí takých ako ste vy. And our job is to help them to get a sheep what their goals are. A úlohou komunitného centra je pomáhať ľuďom v tom, čo oni chcú a podporovať ich nápady, ich myšlenky. So, we are, I like the English phrase public servant. Andrea sa mi sa páči anglický výraz, 
niečo také ako verejný e, služobník, doslovne to public servant, dali by sme to ako, ale to chápete, hej, ako služobník e, verejnosti, ako verejná služba, servant, hej. So that's, we are really servants. Takže oni skutočne sú vlastne služobníkmi. So I'm not deciding what people should do there. Oni, oni nerozhodujú, čo ľudia majú robiť. But uh, we have still have some regulations and rules how to use the house, so it will work for everybody. And as Muslim said, we, we, have, we have a focus on families, which really need to get integrated in the local community. We also focus, also target those who are socially excluded and try to also take them in to the majority. Because all citizens need to interact. Pretože, ako tam poukazuje na tú prvú vetu, for all citizens, ich komunitné centrum je pre všetkých občanov. So this is the entrance. Toto je vstup. Mm-hmm. And uh, the good thing is that uh, it's, o- it's open. Uh, čo je dobré na tom je to, že je to otvorené. Every day. A každý deň. From morning to late night. Od rána do neskorého večera, do neskorej noci. And the reason uh, for this is, I think this, the management partnership that we have. Uh, čo je dôležité povedať o manažerskom partnerstve. Mm-hmm. Uvidíme, čo sa stalo vykoje, ako nám to vysvetli, hej. Prekladom tako manažerské mm-hmm. partnerstvo. The cafe is open all night. Kaviare je otvorená celú noc. So when I'm here, I'm, or I go home from work after office hours, The cafe will maintain house and keep it open. So they are really a good partner. Yeah. And we also have a, a large yoga school, which is professional. And the community members which are going there, they pay participate. And they have a very big part of our activities. Uh, uh, what do you mean that they are a big part of the pie? A big part of the pie. And they work together, of course. The cafe uh, is uh, earning from the clients going also going to the cafe. So it's really a win-win situation for all. A z tohto vyplýva, že pre každého je to vhodná situácia. People go to the cafe and then they find out about uh, political meetings, about activities, what's going on. Ľudia chodia do kaviarni, aby si prediskutovali, čo sa deje v politike, čo sa vôbec deje tam. So you don't have to go there uh, with an agenda. Nemusíte tam ísť s nejakým plánom. Just for a cup of coffee. So the cafe keeps it open. And the yoga school. Uh, and they also give classes for babies. So the social network in the community starts here. Takže v podstate tá spoločenská sieť začína mm-hmm. už tu. Getting to know each other. Uh, Spoznávanie jeden druhého. Then we go to kindergarten, they know each other, they start to build mm-hmm. a sense of community. Spomína škôlku a mm-hmm. už vlastne tu začínajú tie prvé, ako sa povie, kroky pri budovaní komunity. 
And then they also see that the house are inviting for ideas. A zároveň treba pripomenúť, že ich komunita, alebo teda, teda ten dom, alebo house, ako hovorí, je otvorený myšlienkam a nápadom ľudí. So they build network and they get active, because they see the possibilities. Majú veľa možností tam na to, aby boli aktívni. 